Even with a vaccine, there will still be a need for effective COVID treatments, and those include antibodies from people who've recovered from COVID-19. Health officials are asking anyone who has recovered to please donate plasma. Today, I got a look at the need in our area and what you can do. Right now, Hamilton Southeastern Social Studies teacher Neil Wagner is in the ICU at Community Hospital North fighting COVID-19. The doctors are telling me that he needs to have convalescent COVID-19 plasma. Um, that there's currently none available. Now his wife Leah is reaching out in person and online, trying to get others to donate. My reaction is to contact everybody I can and ask them to donate or have um, somebody that they know who's had COVID-19 to donate. That's what Community Health Network President Brian Mills did at the Versity Blood Center today. He first tested positive eight months ago, and since learning how his plasma can help, he's donated 11 times. And to me, when I found out that I had had um, antibodies and I could donate these and this would help other people, I said, I'm glad to do that. Officials at Versity say the current supply of convalescent plasma can't keep up with the current surge in cases. So some patients like Neil are having to wait until more who've recovered from the virus make the choice to donate. So I believe that that people have just forgotten that that is something that they can do because they couldn't do it before. For Leah, she's doing her part to get people to donate plasma, and she was able to briefly talk to her husband today. And he wanted to send out a thank you to everybody who uh, is working in the hospital system, everybody who's trying to help.